Hey guys, what's up? I just wanted to make a quick video to show you how to um, switch the Wi-Fi cards or the wireless cards on your laptops. So I had a problem with my HP ProBook 6360B right here. Um, the screen got damaged and the trackpad is not working. So I decided just to switch the Wi-Fi card. So I took the hard drive out of this and I'm going to put it in this Elite Book. This is a 8460W Elite Book. So I took the hard drive out, out of it, as you can see, right here. And I put the hard drive in, um, in this Elite Book 8460. So they're pretty much the same laptop, you know, even though this is a Pro Book and that's an Elite Book. They're pretty much the same, so I'm going to see if I could switch the Wi-Fi card. So I already started removing a card right here. So you just take out the two screws right here. And you just unplug the two cables right here. So I'm going to do that quickly. So you hope you guys can see. So I decided just to make a video of this since I was doing it already. So as you can see, I already removed um, the screws from the card. So I'm going to take the card out. And we'll remove them like this. It remembers these two. These are actually for um, M.2. This actually has a M.2 slot, which I didn't know is right here. It's on top. So um, that's what the other cables are for. So I'm just going to switch the Wi-Fi card. And there it is. This one has Bluetooth. So I don't know if um, the other Wi-Fi card in my... And my um, ProBook 6360 has Bluetooth. I don't remember. I think it don't. But I'm going to take it out and see. So right here, this is it. So you want to do the same thing. There you go. Get the screw. Screws on my magnetic. This one's not sticking. Let's see if I get it out. This one don't want to come out. I'll try to do this real quickly as possible. So, I'll take it out this way. Of course, you want to remove these first. I'm just doing this real quick right now, but um, you want to take some little connectors or pliers and just, you know, remove the um, switch right here. I'm sorry, not the switch, but these little um, connectors. And again, I don't have my tools with me right now, so I'm just doing this on the fly. But you want to, you know, do it right. You want to get your pliers. But I don't have any right now. I did get to them, so. So I'm going to see how this works. So I took out, this is the Wi-Fi card. So I'm just going to put it in my Elite Book and see what happens. And the reason why I'm doing this, I forgot to mention, is that, um, once, you know, I put the switch to hard drive, um, this laptop could not detect the Wi-Fi card, so um, that was already in it. So I don't know if it was because I'm using different hard drive, different drivers for, you know, different laptop, but it would not detect the wireless card. So I'm thinking maybe it's because of the drivers that's on, on the other laptop. So I'm going to use the same wireless card that's on my other computer see if that would fix the problem so what you do you just want to connect them again this is uh and this is really hard to see let's see if i get a good view remove the battery forgot to mention that but i was so in a hurry um that's the first thing you want to do before you you know remove this is remove the battery 
So there's no, you know, electricity or static electricity that would short out the circuits or the circuit board. So what you want to do is put the bottom panel. I have two of these, so let's see which is this the one right now. Yeah. So that's about it. As you can see, both cables are connected. And let's see if this fixed the problem. So I'll boot it up real quick before my time runs out. Here we go. Got about 30 seconds left. So it's going to boot up. Okay, um, got it on. Let's check. Oh, there you go. Look at that. It's connected to the internet. Look at that. It's connected. There's a the Wi Fi. Okay, there you go. As you can see, it's working. There it is. Thank you very much for watching. Goodbye.